So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to search and type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator and then click on yes. Now once you're on this, we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS and click on enter. Then we're going to type in netsh space winsock space reset and click on enter again. It's going to ask you to restart the computer, but don't do it yet to so complete the next steps in the video. Now for the second step, you want to head over to search and type in view network connections. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to find your network adapter. So this one's mine right here. You want to double click on it and then click on properties and then click on internet protocol version 4. Then you want to make sure that use the following DNS server just has been selected. You want to make the first line 8888 and you want to make the second line 8844 and then click on OK. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search again and type in Windows Defender Firewall. Click on it. Now once it's on this, we're going to click on Advanced Settings. Then we're going to click on Inbound Rules. Then you want to click on New Rule. You want to click on Port and then click on Next. Then you want to type in 49152-65535 and then click on Next. Click on Next again. Click on Next. And then just type in Rainbow as the name. Click on Finish. Now for the last step, you want to head over to Search and type in Network Reset. Click on it. Now once it's on this, you want to click on Reset Now and then click on Yes. Now once you complete all the steps in the video, you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.